Hey, bro, what you, what you, what's that? You got the Book of Mormon? Oh, yeah, I was in the hospital and the Mormon lady dropped this on me. Hey, that book is garbage, bro. I'm going to tell you straight up. Hey, throw yeah. that, throw well, that in the I trash. Mean, it already says that it's another testament of Jesus Christ. That book belongs in the so trash can. So I'm like, another testament? No. I'm already suspicious. Let me get Isaiah 34 I, and verse 16. Throw, yeah. that, throw that in the garbage. You're prove that, that Mormon book, it up. Is, you shouldn't even have that in your hand. Okay. Hey, in that yeah. book, and let's go to uh, first Nephi. No, nah, no. Let's go to First Nephi. I think it's five and twenty-one. I think that's what it is. First Nephi in that book that you got, your book. Yeah. That book. Yeah. Let's see that book. Get that book. Hand it to him. Read that. First Nephi. Let's read that right there. It should be in there. Watch this right here. So this, you're a black man, right? Right. Okay. Second Nephi five twenty-one, and he had caused the cursing to come upon them. Yea, even a sore cursing because of their iniquity. For behold, they had hardened their hearts against him, that they had become like unto a flint. Wherefore, as they were white and exceedingly fair and delightsome. So they were white and exceedingly fair and delightsome, these people that did sin read. That they might not be enticing unto my people, the Lord God, did cause a skin of blackness to come upon them. So in this book, it's saying if you got black skin, you curse. Wow. So now let's go to the Bible. Let's read about Jesus Christ. Bring it up. Let's see what color Christ was. Wake up. Revelation 1, verse 14. Bring it up. His head and his hairs were white like wool, as white as snow. And his eyes were as a flame of fire. And his feet like unto fine brass, as if they burned in a furnace. So Christ was a black man. So we got the depiction of him right here. So it, according to that book, Jesus Christ is cursed because of his sin. Wake and him up! If I was you, I, you know what I would do with that book? I would take that book, I would run as fast as I could to that trash can right there and slam dump that thing right in that trash can. Hey, look, go ahead, go ahead. Hey, take that book, right there. You see that trash can? I wouldn't even put it in the recycle. I would put it right in the trash. I wouldn't even recycle it. Hey, come on up, all right? Yeah, the Book of Mor Mormon has nothing to do with the Bible. The Book of Moron, I should say. Let me go, go to Isaiah 34 and 16. There you go. All praise to the Most High. That's exactly where that book belongs. Go ahead. Isaiah 34 verse 16. Seek ye out of the Book of the Lord. Seek ye out of the Book of the what? The Book of the Lord and read. This is what we're supposed to be reading out of the Bible, and only the Bible. Because of what? Read. No one of these shall fail. None of the prophecies in the Bible shall fail. The Bible is a history book. Everything that the Bible prophesied, not everything, but most things that the Bible prophesied has came to pass. There's many more things that have been prophesied that is going to come to pass. That's right. Read. None shall want her mate. None shall want her mate. No, no book. You don't need to mix this Bible with any other book because the Bible is the one and only true book.